What's up guys, VB Chan here. Hope you guys are doing well. So today we are finally going to start season 2 of Jujutsu Kaisen episode 1 and 2 or episode 25 and 26 I think. Let me just uh, jump into the episodes. We have, I have to switch the season, season 2. 25 and 26 is correct. Based off the thumbnail, I feel like we're going to get into the backstory of Suguru Gedo and uh, Gojo Satoru. I enjoyed the movie. I can't wait to see Okotsu Yuta in season 2. I'm excited. Let's get into the episodes. Suguru Ghetto Dam. Man, he's seeing the world in black and white. Or is it just nighttime? It's so gloomy. Curses are lurking nearby. Oh, there you go. He did say he was. He looks younger in a school uniform. He was collecting strong curses. The Titan curse. Tastes like. <laughs> mm, oh yeah, his ability. Oh my god, young Goja. The day they separate. Oh my god, look at this 480p. Maybe it's like 240p. Mm. And then when the rumor spread, the haunted places get stronger. Internet. It's like, must be serious if they're charging me, if they're paying me my high rate. Call it negotiation. Whoa. Yep, yeah, has to be the house on top of the high mountain. That one house on a hill. Is this lady the teacher from the Kyoto school? I don't sense the present of her being cursed. Yeah, they're luring. They want you to come in. <laughs> I was like, Gedo would love this place. <laughs> Mesa.
Oh, wow. I like the camera work, you know, looking at the different angles. Luckily, it's daytime. Oh, nice. I feel like they should not separate. <laughs> or maybe she wants the other girl to do more of the work? Nah. Is that blood? You know, same. I would be like so prepared to open the door and find something behind it. Mm -mm. All right, get ready for the jump scare. Oh no, when the door closes, you're trapped. Is, like, a domain gonna activate? That was an interesting animation. Did she close the door? <laughs> what a troll. Mm, there's something eerie. Oh, this is the first floor. So there's another. It's connected. They're stuck here in a loop. Mm. Look at this, like the wall dividing and the distortion. Ooh, once they've entered, it already activated. Majides. Hmm, maybe you could save your energy and then when it attacks you, you defeat it? We could escape this barrier. Is there something, a weak spot?
opposite directions at the same time. Oh, so it's going to break even more. Oh, if you want me to promote you, you gotta hand me some. <laughs> I feel like she's the only one running. Anna. Hey, at least they escaped. Oh, she got saved. Oh my god, I love his cocky attitude. Oh, that's why she hates him. Okay, that was a pretty cool opening. I didn't expect how peaceful it is. Wait, so is this I have no idea what this season's about, but it seems like it's all a flashback. Because when I see the promotion pictures, it's, you know, Go young Gojo Wageto. I just assume it would be a continuation of, you know, uh, Yuji and friends. Hey, but I'm excited to learn about all these characters. Oh my god, Gojo and Gedo look so fun together. Like, look, seeing them have this genuine happiness on their face, it's like, how did they drift apart? When did Godo, Gedo have these f feelings? Gedo kind of looks like uh, Todo here. Aww. Oh my god, I love he's teasing her. Oh, that's all she cares about. <laughs> I love G Gedo and Gojo are so cute when they're like just ah. <laughs> Oh my goodness, Principal Sun. First grade sorcerer. Like look at their faces, it's so cute. Oh my god, I, I would love to put on his glasses too.
Yeah, so he had a different mindset back then. How did he get to where he is now? Signing my Damn. Slam duck. Oh my god. Raise her. Mm. Yeah, if he lost his will, he'll lost his power. Wow. That is a very interesting... <laughs> oh my god, the Digimon reference! Oh my god, the Coralmon... Yeah, because usually you don't go to Skull Greymon, you go to Metal Greymon, because Skull Greymon is the dark version. <laughs> oh my god, the Windows XP! Mm, and you gotta make sure everything goes right. Yeah, because this literally will be the end of the Jujutsu world if something happens to that girl. But isn't he the strongest? Watashi. Boku. I love how wild and just like free Gojo is. He just says and does whatever he wants. He has a very carefree personality. Oh, 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 a bomb? Hi Q in the house. 
Oh, that was his curse that protected him. Oh my god, it's the Quincy's that are here. Oh my god, it's kind of a Quincy reference too, because they got letters. Oh my god, stop getting so close. His eyes are so mesmerizing. <gasps> Zayn, is it Megumi's dad? Megumi's dad, Fushigura. Oh my god, his voice. Oh god. <laughs> it's um Dio. <laughs> ah, damn it. Uh let me skip and then we just go to the next wait, let me see if there's something at the end. I don't know how there's some more. I feel like I'm watching like an older anime. Like something from the 2000s. I like it. Chaku Chaku no Mako, what? And play. Nice hot cup of coffee in the morning. Oh, sorry, tea. And a cube of sugar. Is someone dying in the background? Oh, he has the... It's probably torturing the Q people. Honestly, I kind of feel bad for him. What a horrible way to die. Kissed by the cursed monster. He's gonna kill you. You don't even care! <laughs> Lol. Bye, son. You should stop talking. Ooh. Oh my god, Gojo is so adorable. <laughs> yeah, he has like a great personality. <laughs> oh my god, Megumi's dad. He looks like Megumi, but without the, like, long hair.
When's the last time you saw your kid? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is one of the coolest way to an intro of an opening. I love that. And then it's so peaceful. Yeah, this arc is nothing what I expected. I guess, like I said, I thought we were going to continue with the Yuji and them. Yeah, I, like I said, based off of the promotional poster pictures, I should have known it was going to be about them. I just thought this would be a little thing, but I guess it's a whole arc. I know this season's going to have, like, at least 20-some episodes. 24? So... Maybe there's like two or three arcs here. Uh, this is definitely an uh, intro I'm going to be listening to a lot. It sounds good. I love the friendship. I, I'm just, I just love Gojo's personality so much. It's so positive and happy. But yeah, he's so strong. And then it's surprising to see Ghetto. I always get his name wrong. Ghetto? Ghetto? Yeah, interact with Gojo. Because, like, they're similar and different at the same time. <sighs> Reverse cursed energy. She looks like Nobara. <laughs> Sensene. Don't fall in love. Like her. All the girls in this show are very well written. They don't come off as the very typical, like, uh, easy girl. Oh my god! You're gonna break her! Oh, yamete kurasai! Oh my god, those braids. You're gonna die. <laughs> is she a cat? What is. Bang guy's technique. Oh, his curse. Aggressive. Oh, so she knows her mission. She's ready to die for this. Well, it's not really dying. She's assimilating. So they just become one. Well, at least you're excited about this. All girls private school? Oh, damn. Who knows what she's gonna make them do? Yeah, that's what I'm scared of. I'm like, you sure you want to assimilate? It doesn't sound that happy, but if... <laughs> Yeah, she wants to do this.
Oh. Always a car accident. Wait, did they say car? I guess I just assumed. Oh, that's a nice compliment. I guess Gojo doesn't have a lot of sense. Like you can see Ghetto is more polite and formal. Two have been Is she bullied? What? Ah, uh, they're coming for her. Oh, shoot. <laughs> that scared me. I was like, what was that? Music in this period. They'd fall for them. I think he's the type of person where when he actually wins, some very bad luck is going to happen. Five. Yeah, you know, main character vibes. She's got to enter at the last minute. Not even an apology. Don't mess with him. Oh, he knows. Wait. You know, he's got that gangster, um, what's it called? Crouch. They won't be able to kill the Star Platinum Vessel. Damn, the disrespect. Oh my gosh, are those Nokia phones? Oh, isn't it bad luck to stick a chopstick like that?
I don't think so. Goodbye, old man. Damn. Oh. What a transition. It's a trap. You're so cute. Good boy, good boy. He's dead? What? I can't believe the reference because like you know they always joke like my life flashed before my eyes oh that's the choir singing mm -mm, mm -mm. Buster she's Oh yeah, they're in middle school. Her number. Ah, Sensei! He's still underage. Honestly, any woman would fall for Goja. That's like, this is like the normal reaction. Mm-hmm. Wow, what a terrible mask. Dang, I don't... I don't know if she has any curse technique, but she's good with that mop. <laughs> How come they 
making that paper bag feels like an actual mask. It's just the paper bag mask. Wow, they have the lame paper bag mask. He's like, I'm doing all the hard work. Oh, it's a clone. You can't touch him. I remember him talking about the infinite, the closer you get, the slower. I'm really enjoying this music, this animation, Gojo. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Bye, man. <laughs> what a tease. <laughs> Damn, that was crazy. Mmm, so he hasn't mastered it? Oh no, kidnapped? But Gedo was there. What? That's the end! That's the end! Oh, she smokes? This is so peaceful and calming. Beautiful dreamer.
You can't ask that. And we stop here before the movie. Okay, well, that was some amazing ep two episodes that we watched. A lot of information to uncover. Let's get into it. First off, personality-wise, we could see the three in the group. Oh my god, what's the girl's name? Suzuko? I, I forgot. I'm so sorry. I gotta go back. And then we got... Gedo and Gonjo and uh yeah that I can see like they both have their similarities like they can tease and like joke around but we can see that Gedo is more serious and uh, formal and he takes his job more seriously looks wise I mean I'm not saying Gojo doesn't take his job seriously but he has a more fun carefree just the free personality that he expresses and i really like that like he just speaks his mind he just does whatever he feels in the moment he's not there to hide any part of himself I feel like he could be all serious like uh, listening or like talking and then he just jumps into this like goofy mood which i love it's just so fun like when he kind of serious barges into the choir room and or chapel i forget and then he he's like Oh my god, I forgot the girls. Is it Rico? And all, yeah, and all the girls in there, which is us, the fans, like, just swooning, falling for Gojo. It's like, oh my god, it's a high schooler. He's gorgeous. He's got his hair, his eyes, right? Even the sensei, the teacher was like, um, here's my number for ya. <laughs> yeah, like, he's got that, like, Gojo just oozes pheromones. I don't know, just, like, something about him. Yeah, and, like, he easily is, I can see, I know he is, like, the most popular character. I don't see any other characters coming close to him. Yeah, you might have a lot of uh, Yuji fans, Okotsu fan, Megumi, Gedo, Nanami, but I think like it's gotta be Gojo. Anyways, I I'm falling. I'm falling for Gojo. I need to like get out of this. So basically, Tenken Sama is trying to avoid evolution so he can not be an immortal being god like i'm wondering what tengen sama looks like but that's not the point he has this uh star vessel that that he will assimilate with so he will stop transformation or evolution as he calls it oh my gosh i love the comparison that uh gojo makes with digimon because that <laughs> ah. so they gotta protect this girl and surprisingly she is content she is happy to become one with tengen i'm not sure if this is like her actual true feelings or someone's just been telling her this and she just truly believes it but anyway she wants to do this and uh, she got no other family member i wonder how she became the star vessel being like uh how did they find her it's just it's just a one in a bajillion people who have this and she's the one Anyways, maybe they'll explain more later. And uh, yeah, Gojo and Gedo are assigned to take care of her. We see other side characters that uh, we know, like Utahime and uh, Meimei and the principal, who is like just a ranked one sorcerer at the moment to be next principal. And yeah, it's just a lot of fun moments with all of them. There's like a lot of talking, so I'm probably gonna have to rewatch the two episodes to see what I missed. Yeah, but at this moment, Ghetto just seems like your average high schooler, like fighting for justice, like to protect the people from curses. So I'm just wondering how from year two he moved over. Yeah, he could call forth any curse that he has on hand and like easily shoots them at that old man like that fight was incredible yeah that old man didn't even see him coming the old man's like oh he probably doesn't have any close combat skills and man did that old man get beat up yeah and then he saw his little doggy i don't <laughs> i don't want to mention this life flash before his eyes i was like oh my gosh they know it like i loved it. one of my favorite things about jujutsu kaisen is they actually refer to real life people like Jennifer Lawrence, Sebastian Stan, and references to other animes. One of the strongest points of Jujutsu Kaisen is the characters are very strongly written in my opinion. Because I think most characters are very like typical character. But I was surprised that the girls got, yeah, Rika has some spunk to her. And I also, we didn't get to see much. Is this uh, Suzuka or Shoko? I forget the third girl in uh, Gojo and Gedo's group, her name. But uh, she seems like uh, she fits well with them. She They said, 
they mentioned that she's got like a reverse curse or something and like Gojo and Gedo were like so confused trying to learn it and like it's a fun chemistry like I like how much chemistry all of the characters in uh, Jujutsu Kaisen have with one another oh yeah we also saw Megumi's dad who is like Hushiguro Toji? Tojin? I forget. He used to be a Zane, but he took his wife's name, Shiguro. And uh, I believe he's just waiting around until like the last minute to jump in. Like the main villain. I, I, I know in the episode I call him like the main character, but he's more like a main, main villain. And uh, I think it'd be interesting to see him fight Gojo because they're like implying that Tojin is super strong. Maybe that's why Megumin is really strong. I mean, he's from the Zayn family, must be strong. One dude was asking him, like, how's Megumi doing? He's like, huh? Who the hell is that? Like, you don't know your own kid's name? What? Or maybe he does one of those things where, you know how sometimes dads just forget all these, like, important information about a kid? Like, maybe he just, he knows he has a kid, but he doesn't, like, think too much. Or maybe he's drunk or something. He's not focusing. He's, like, gambling on horse racing. Yeah, and he keeps losing. <laughs> and, uh, oh my god, his voice by, uh, same as uh, Dio's actor. <laughs> like, the, when you hear that voice, it's like, oh, it's, it's him. It's, that's the voice, right? And then there's gonna be a bunch of, like, JoJo <laughs> jokes. It is I, Dio! <laughs> I, I can see it. And, uh... I guess we get introduced to the maid. Her name is like Kuroi or something. And uh, she's pre I don't know if she could use any curses, but she's doing really well with that mop and uh, aim for the guy's balls. She got good reflexes. She dodged some of the punches. Like, that's a big dude. And uh, Gojo, he said something about, I think, six eyes and the infinity thing. No one can touch him when he turns it on. They just get slower when they get near him. And I think uh, Rika is getting more and more impressed. Or it's just like the adrenaline. Because you're with Gojo, everything is wow to me. Like, his eyes are so gorgeous. Like, I think his eyes are bigger in this. It's beautiful. He said he couldn't use that red technique. So, I know in the current day, he can use it. He makes the red with the blue, make the purple, kaboom. Yeah, he... So, I, at first I was like, is he joking? Like, he just didn't want to destroy the guy. But I think he hasn't perfected the red yet. So, a little bit more time, he'll get it. Then we end the episode with Kuroi getting caught to be continued. Yeah, so far, excellent setup. I am very excited to continue watching more episodes. Feel free to leave me your comments and thoughts. What you think? What do you think about Gedo and Gojo's personality? Like, all of their personalities, I, I just love to hear more about these characters. They're so fun. Like, there's no, like, unlikable characters. Almost all, I think all the characters are very enjoyable and likable. I don't even want to go back to Sukuna and, uh, uh, um, oh my god, Yuji. I'm like, forget, I'm sorry, I have such a bad memory. I'm gonna have to be taking notes. I wrote all their names down, so I'm gonna have to write even more names down and try to remember. Like, each season, I gotta rewatch the season, so I actually remember what happened because bad memory I have and that is it for the reaction thank you guys so much for watching feel free to leave me your comments and thoughts I'll be sure to read them and see you guys for next reaction peace out